It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. I first want to start this video by talking about the levels of English proficiency in other countries. And the main reason why I'm doing this is because I want to talk about like the art of translation. And particularly in a video that I'm going to respond to, because I feel as though that translation is something that is really serious and that we should not try to misinform people as much as possible. Now it's true that every time you translate, you cannot, you know, convert the language to the target language 100% all the time because of different reasons and factors, right? However, the whole entire purpose of translation is to get the same sort of message across to people, no matter the language. Now, according to uh, this graph right here for the English index levels, now the highest levels of English include like the Netherlands, Denmark, Finland, Sweden, Norway, and then like one of the lowest levels of English is pretty much Spain. And so for this video, we're gonna respond to a video that I saw the other day, and I just cannot believe how badly translated the video was. So, Without further hesitation, let's check out the video. I'm not sure if it's like intentional or not. I'm not sure what the context about this video is, but essentially what we see right now is a journalist who potentially going up to like a British guy. He, of course, does not understand Spanish. And so he has to answer the question in English. And so for this part, it seems as though that after he said what he said in English, she kind of mistranslated what he said in Spanish. So let's first watch the video first, and then I'm going to break it down for you guys to understand. English, do you have a mask? Do you have to wear a face mask? In English, it's specific. Face mask. Yeah. Uh, what, what about the face mask? What do I think? Uh, I don't like it, but um, I understand why it's necessary. Um, and it's just one of those things that I think we have to accept that it's a, a small uh, price to pay to uh, get back to normal. Nos está comentando que él no lleva la mascarilla porque considera que no es necesario pues llevar el tapabocas cuando está aquí en la playa y cuando hay distancia de seguridad y en estos momentos tampoco hay mucha gente aquí en la playa. De... The main reason I'm reacting like this is because what she said in Spanish right now is nothing what he said in English at all. So let's go back in English, like the English part. This is how I would translate this part in English, right? I'm going to go step by step for you guys just to show how I would translate it in English. Uh, I don't like it, but... Uh, no me gusta tapabocas. Um, I understand why it's necessary. Pero entiendo por qué es necesario. Um, and it's just one of those things that I think we have to accept that it's... Y es una de las cosas que tenemos que aceptar. A, a small uh, price to pay for potentially helping Spain uh, get back to normal. Como una pequeño precio a pagar para potentialmente ayudar a España para regresar a la normalidad. So basically what I was saying is the English, like the Spanish part for that English, right? But I'm going to try to translate like what she said in Spanish to give you guys an idea why it's just super wrong. Nos está comentando que él no lleva la mascarilla porque considera que no es necesario pues llevar el tapabocas cuando está aquí en la playa y cuando hay distancia de seguridad. Okay, basically she was saying in Spanish is that he is saying he is not wearing masks because he's considered it not necessary to wear face masks when he's on the beach and when there's social distancing. So that reporter right there, I'm not sure it's because of her low level of English or not, if it's manipulation or not, but what she said right now is completely false. Completely false. I heard that the election in Madrid is coming out really shortly. And so naturally, of course, I guess the news media is trying to smear Madrid right now. And so let's check out the translation, the subtitles of this video. 
Esta dicen cosas como estas. Now you saw in the video, like basically, the woman said Spain. But let's go to the subtitles here, right? Now the subtitles right here pretty much says like Madrid. It said Madrid. Now in Spanish, Spain is pretty much España. Okay? So, siento que España, you have to write España in this part. Now, what else did she said in the video? Now, countries in Spanish is like uh, Bice. And so they write like uh, cities right there for the subtitles instead of countries. And so it seems as though that they got the whole entire thing wrong for political purposes and tried to smear, I guess, Madrid for this clip. But uh, it seems as though that uh, I'm not sure why they're doing this sort of stuff for the agenda, right? Because to me, the most important thing about translation is not to manipulate the information that you're trying to process through the other language. Because to me, when I'm translating something to another language, right, like from Spanish to English or whatever, I want to make sure that the text is as close as possible for that language. So I don't understand why there are like companies, mega corporations that are trying to, you know, take advantage of the Spanish people and try to lie about what they're saying. Because obviously, of course, not everyone going to speak English. And so you're going to have to have like the best sort of subtitles or, or like some sort of interpretation services to help people out what they're trying to say. There's like no need to actually manipulate the data or like, you know, what they're saying to do some sort of political statement. But what? The, but that's my personal stuff anyway. What do you guys think? Tell me in the comment section down below. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. He's your only black friend, so he's your best black friend. <laughs> because black friends are rare as you should be aware. He smiles like Richard Pryor, so just sit and stare. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler. It's everyone's friend, it's Tyler.